Gas prices are going down, but not by much. AAA says the average price in California is now 640, down about four cents from a week ago. In Sacramento, you can now expect to pay 638, Stockton 633, and Modesto, where it is ticking up at 630. But you may have noticed a type of fuel running about two dollars cheaper. Two dollars cheaper. It's called E85 gas. So what is it, and who can use it? CBS 13's Andrew Hopner is getting answers. It's cheaper, but is it safe to use? I have a Chevy that I run um, on E85. E85 gasoline is sometimes known as flex fuel and consists of 51 to 83 percent corn ethanol instead of petroleum. Vehicles from Ford Escapes to Chevy Tahoes are already built to run on it. One benefit, it's currently a lot cheaper. Um, I fueled up $89 full tank. I have also a Toyota that I have that takes regular gas and it was over $95 and it has only a 19 gallon tank. Gene Caravan and Vladimir Maximov run Autobahn Davis and believe in E85's use, but there are some drawbacks. The gasoline has less fuel mileage than normal petroleum gas and a car would need to be tuned to run on it if it doesn't already. They just yeah, do tune up on your vehicle or couple vehicles mm -hmm. and just enjoying cheap gas. At UC Davis, Colin Murphy leads the low carbon fuel policy research initiative. It's one of the tools that we have and one of the tools that, that we can get even more benefit than we are right now. He says that E85 gasoline is a bridge towards a low carbon future, but its benefit as a cheap fuel for consumers has flown under the radar. Without a real strong push from the environmental community, uh, to get a lot more corn ethanol in or the automakers, it, it was just sort of, it was a thing that was there. It's providing some environmental benefit um, and, and has kind of sort of stayed flying at that level for, for a while now. And guys, just to exemplify the price difference here between your normal run-of-the-mill petroleum gas and this new E85, these prices up here are kicking up on the plus side towards 6 dollars 50. That's 650 a gallon. Now just step over here. The strange thing is these are available at 2,000 gas stations across the country. 419 for E85 gasoline. And as we mentioned, Chevy and Ford are already flex fuel compliant. And if you want to, you can go get tuned up and have your car be flex fuel compliant as well. Really going to help out when gas is skyrocketing the way it has been.